Hey, what's up everybody? David here, your Android Junkie, or at AndroidSpeed.com, doing a little product review of something that uh, we came across. So, here it is. This is the Blue Wii Nighthawk. Well, if you're Nighthawk, I'm Dragon. Step Brothers reference. Anyways, um, basically what this is, it's a Bluetooth... Um, earpiece as well as a Bluetooth microphone. Not too bad. Um, it's uh, kind of cool. It's got a little clip-on thingy here. Hi. Anyways, um, it's not too bad. Um, I like it. like it for phone calls, but there's a couple dislikes I have, so let's dive right into it, shall we? All right, guys, here's the unit right here. Here's the Blue Wii Nighthawk. Um, let's just take a look at what we have here. Of course, we got some volume buttons in the front as well as a little label right there. Um, we got the push to talk. This is, I believe, for just push-to-talk phones, if you have that function. We've got the power button right here. Um, to turn it on, you do have to hold down for a couple seconds or a few seconds, um, which is kind of weird, but it's all right. Uh, we got the uh, charging USB right here, input. And then, of course, we got the um, little earpiece. Whoa, easy there. Easy there, little guy. We'll get to that guy later. Um, we got the little earpiece right here that just plugs in right here. And then it fits comfortably in your ear. And basically what this guy does is when you're in your car or something, and you want to be hands-free, of course, don't want to break the law, you're going to hook this guy. And what this little guy does right here is act as an amplifier. So if you clip this on your little um, sun guard thingy, major um, your phone call, when you answer a phone call, it'll amplify it and you can hear the person and talk right back to them. Um, as you can see right here, here's your little microphone. So that's pretty cool. But um, other than that, you could just use this and just put it right in your ear. Now, um, the Bluetooth part of it for phone calls, I like. It's not bad, I've used it a few times. Um, it's clear, it works. I, you know, if my phone is on my bed or something, I'm talking, I just pop this in my ear and just hold this instead or clip it on my shirt. Not too bad at all. Um, if you watch the the little um, video where it shows all the functions, they they show a function where you know you can record a video on your phone, which we'll look at the app in a little bit, and they're using this as a microphone. Do not like that whatsoever, especially since. I am, you know, make the, the Mandroid show and stuff like that. I was kind of hoping that the microphone would be a lot better. But if you're going to record a video, the audio is terrible. It's, it sounds like someone's on the phone. Like if you play back the video, it just sounds like someone's on the phone. It's not clear audio at all. I do not recommend it for video taking. But re recommend it big time for, you know, hands-free Bluetooth in the car. So let's take a look at the app here. I'm get my phone. It's plugged into my computer right now. Ha! Ah. Let it go, computer. Okay. Oh, hi, Batman. Hi, Batman. All right, and here's the app. Here's the app right here. It's opening up. And as you can see, we got this right here. This is basically your recordings. I already recorded one little brief thing, but it'll list all your recordings right here for you. Um, you got the record button right there, and then you got your choice. Oh, I actually don't even know what that button does. Yeah, just makes a clicking noise. Then you got your choice if you want to do video or you just want to do audio. So if you just wanted to record the audio off something, and of course, you know, you just, you know, sync it up with Bluetooth to your phone and blah, 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 and there you go. You could record some audio. But like I said, I just don't like that part at all because the audio just, I mean, if you're going to record video, it's better just to use the phone's microphone because if you use this, it's just going to sound like someone's talking on the phone. Like in the video, the lady actually is like interviewing people and blah 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 and I'm like and she's holding this up to like them and it's just, it just doesn't work for me for that that's the only downside though other than that using it as a Bluetooth device for your phone I would recommend it it's not a bad not not bad at all especially with this little amplifier and the fact that you could just clip it on your little sun guard and just talk to somebody that's pretty cool I don't mind that at all but anyways guys that's pretty much it well, all right, guys, hope you liked that little product review of uh, the Blue Wii Nighthawk. Um, um, you know, if you want to check it out, I'll have a link down below. Um, I have a, I'll have a written review of it, too, maybe a little more in-depth, but it's pretty much, that's how it is. Downside is, don't use it for video. I'm not going to use it for video, unless you want to use it for video. I wouldn't recommend it for video, but for in the car, talking on the phone, Bluetooth, hands-free, excellent. Video, not so good. 
But anyways, guys, hit that like, thumbs up button. If you like this video, subscribe to the Android Spin channel for more product views and, of course, constant Android content. Well, I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com, and this has been a product review of Blue Wee Nighthawk. Like I said, I'm Dragon. I keep on referencing Step Brothers. Why?